there and welcome back to Lumia's tutorial video series. Today I will show you how to create a new template or clip art for your website in Lumis, and it will be super easy for you. Okay, the first thing you need to click customize your custom product to access the front end of Lumis. So now you can creatively create your template from your clip art text, image, and shape. Let's get started by select a random clip art. I take this one. A random text, a random shape. You can click or draw the image over here to use. Okay, so this about section that allow you to edit all of these elements. You just click on specific element that you want to edit. For example, I click on the text. I can change the font family to others. In the next few videos, I will show you how to add the new font for your website. You can edit the text. You can change the font size as well. Letter spacing and line head. There's all the options like text effect, text aligned, and text colors. If you like more colors, just click on it and drag to the color that you like. If it's not on the color pane over here, just add it for the later use. Okay, once you finish your editing, click on files and save that files. Go back to the back end of Lumis. Under design templates, you click on add new template. So give your new template a name and this field is mandatory. You can set the price for it if you think your customer has to pay extra to use it. So I make it 10. For example, my product is $40 and if they use this template, they have to pay 50, which is $10 each hour. So if you don't find the categories that you think is fit with this template, you can add the new categories by clicking this one. Give it the name, the parents, thumbnails, and save the categories. It will appear here. So we'll select the natures and sport business as well. The tags are important. It's have your customer easier when they find your template. So making sure you put the relevant tags. Make sure you give it like relevant text. So we're hitting choose the files and upload the file we just download. And you can see here the format is dot lumis l u m i. So you can you can also upload in the PNG or JPG format, but you cannot edit. So the difference is if you upload in this format, you can edit in the editors. save template and now the template has been successfully saved just re-upload it template you can see it's over here right let, let try to search with the text okay it's over here as well so now you can separately edit it okay so after finished the new template so now let's go ahead to create a new clip art simply following the same method that we did with the template earlier so under clip art you click add new clip art fill all the information like the name and categories that I explained before right the tags as well and then upload the design files so it supported all of these files. You can give the price as I mentioned. So let's talk uh, more detail about these files and what the difference between them. So I have a three types of files. The first one is SVG format. The second one in PNG format. And the third one in JPG format. So I will start with the SVG format. I will show you what is the difference. Instead parts okay so for the SVG format the Lumis system can split all the colors like split in the different layers so I can easy to change it in the style I want to 
status but if your clip art in the PNG files say you cannot change the individual layers colors the only thing you can do is change the whole colors of the layers in JPG format so with this format you are not able to edit anything just leave it default like this if you try to edit the colors or anything it's messed up like this all right that's it for today so I just show you how to create a new template and clip ours hopefully this helpful for you and if you have any question just leave on the comment and I will answer it and if you have uh, any problem just contact our support thanks for watching and see you guys in the next videos